Hello, I'm back again, Luter FM, with another Dynamo Tillabisi and Georgia national team save. Uh, and in the last episode, I've started a new format of how I'm doing my football manager content. So I'm kind of just copying what other FM content creators are doing. Um, before, I was showing you every game. And when you're playing in a league that's quite weak, it's easy to dominate domestically. So what I'm going to do moving forward is, um, I mean, last episode I showed a few domestic games because we haven't got any European fixtures with Dynamo until July. And they start their season in like January or something. So um, we've got, in this episode, we're going to be solely focusing on the Georgia national team Euro 2024 games. So that'll be what I'm going to do in this episode. Um, we will, before we do them games, we will look how Dynamo are doing domestically in the league and stuff like that. But yeah, that this episode hopefully will be quite entertaining for you lot. And we'll hopefully see if we can um, do just as well as the Georgia national team did in real life in the Euros. Fingers crossed, I won't let you down. But yeah, um, I'll be back in a sec with the first Georgia game in the Euros. <laughs> Right, so we're coming up to the first game for the Georgia national team. We are playing um, Portugal, then we're playing Poland, and then we're playing Turkey. So I'm not expecting too much against Portugal. Um, we have good news. The assistant manager has decided to call, oh, sorry, wrong, wrong team, has decided to call up um, Kava, Kava Shilia, uh, a.k.a. Cavadonna. So there he is. So our main man is there. We've also obviously got a goalkeeper. Um, we've got him who's pretty good. Him as well. So yeah, so we've got a decent team. We might, I think, I'd be happy with a draw, one last one win in the group stage. Um, but it's going to be tough. We've got, we're not, I don't think we're going to beat Portugal, but you never know. Poland's a good team because they've got Lewandowski and they've got other players as well, don't get me wrong. Turkey's probably the team that we should, if we're going to win, against anybody is going to be them but they're not an easy team either so it's just one then anything can happen but before we go into that game let's just go let's see where dynamo are in the league we are 14 points clear at the top of the league at the moment we've won all 14 we've won 14 games and lost three sorry i, I stand corrected goal difference goal difference is 26 uh, i'm not going to go through every single game that we played since last episode um but that was the last game we played, so if we just go down here like this, we've literally only what lost one game since we since last episode. Um, we're playing Torpedo again the 29th of the 6th, which will be probably after the group stages. Um, we've also got the draw for the Champions League, so we'll know who we've got to play in the qualifying round after this game. So we'll have a look at that. Um, leading goal scorers at the moment for us is Eluzzi and Faria. Um, that's about it, really. I'll just crack on. Oh, so we'll sort this out. Right. First game of the Euros. Let's see how we do. Hopefully. We can surprise Portugal, but they are a strong team. It's Portugal. They've got Ronaldo. They've got Bruno Fernandes. They've got Yeo Felix. They've got a who's who really of quality players. Bernardo Silva. They've got a ridiculous talented team, and it, and it, they just seem to get better every couple of years because they just they just have they just have such good young players coming through all, all time. Yeah, let's see how we get on. I'm, I'd be ecstatic if we get a draw out of this game. But you never know. The longer the game goes without Portugal scoring, you, we might be able to score. We'll see. I feel like we're just setting them up here to set the ball off us at this rate, the way it's going. Yeah, we're quite nervous on the ball, and this is what happens. Gonzalo Ramos with the finish. After we just gave it to him on a silver plate. I'm very disappointed in our defence there. I'm going to berate the team there. Don't mind us losing, but we should not be doing things like that. Right, throw into Portugal. Oh, they got Dalos as well. I keep forgetting how good this team is. Right, 
managed to save that then, thank God for our goalkeeper. Corner to Portugal, Bernardo Silva. Floats it up, headed over there. Is Ronaldo in this team? Probably. Yeah, only one shot on target at the moment. Oh, that might change. Oh, come on, that was our chance. If we were going to score, we were going to score there. But that's promising. Uh, Pavadona with the corner. Nice corner by him. But small positives coming out of that one. Come on, let's let's surprise them. Let's give them a let's give them a, a game at least. Let's try and make them work for it. Cashier. Right. Avadonna. Nice passing going on here. Oh, get in! Cavadonna. George's a best player, gets an equaliser in a game that we weren't expected to do well in. Just like it's just like George in real life. They they uh surprised a, they surprised a lot of people in the Euros. They were definitely the underdogs and they managed to get through the group stage, which wasn't which they people weren't expecting, and they I can't remember who they played. Was it Belgium? But they they basically gave them a good game up until up until the end, and then it just was uh, then all downhill from there. But yeah, all right, let's have a look. Put you on. Uh, you're knackered, Cavadona, so we want to make sure you're fit for the next game. Anybody else? Uh, he needs to come off. He's been playing rubbish. Right, let's see how we get on with the substitutions. But yeah, I mean, if this ends one more, there we go. Thanks, last words. You won. Oh, I just, I just knew it. Surely he's offside though. He was miles offside there. I don't know, understand why he's on. Oh well. Um, it is what it is. Nothing we can do about it. It's just our quality isn't as good as theirs. We got a corner. You never know. I just when I thought this game was over. Oh. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah. Two one. Not the best start, but we were playing the best team in the group, so it was expected. Um. Right. What I'll do is I'll fast forward five days. <laughs> Okay, this is taking longer than I thought. Usually it just goes. <laughs> I think it's because the transfer window is still open. So it's going to take a while because of that reason. Right, I'll just come back in a sec. Bear with us. Right, we're back. Sorry about that. I just thought it's probably easier for you lot just to not have to wait in between the matches. So anyway, we're back. Um, we need to get a point out of this game, or I think it's pretty much game over. I think even if we win the last game. Um, of the of the group stage, which is not, I don't think we're going to qualify. I could be wrong, but yeah, I think we definitely need to get a point, and also for personal pride as well. Poland, obviously, they got Lewandowski, but um, you know, I mean, as much we're probably the same. We've got like a we're probably literally a one man team as well, really, and that's Cavadonna. But we could we could win this. Oh, one nil, get in. Good start to the game after one minute played. 1-0. Equal on points with Poland now. Ah, 1-1. One, one. Lewandowski, what a surprise. In fact, are we man-marking Lewandowski? Position. No, we're not. That poor man management by me. Right, hopefully that will help. 1-1. One, one. Turkey's winning as well, so even if we've got to draw this game at least, because uh, saying that, that if we draw this game, Poland's only got one point as well. They're playing Portugal next game, we're playing Turkey. 
you might get you might have three teams with four points. That I don't, that'll be interesting to see what happens there. But at the moment, it's going to be Portugal and Turkey. Unless obviously we can get a win here, but we can't lose this game. That's that's a definite. We've got to try and win this game and hope for the best. Cavadon is knackered, which is really annoying. He won't be able to play much longer. Not that he's been playing well, 6.4 rating. Hopefully he'll do something now in this highlight and then we can take him off. He's basically got the team on his back here and he's, that's why he's probably knackered because he's the main creative force here. Oof. Worth a try, definitely worth a try. Right, we're in possession again. Cavadonna passes it to Gulabori. Come on, let's forward, not keep passing it back to the defenders. Cashier, I see it, that's more like it. Gives it to Kakavazi. Yes, get him! 2-1, that's what I'm talking about. Right, we're second now. Yeah, Cavadon needs to come off. Um, we'll put on this player here. And then we need to take you off. So who have we got as a right back? Put you on. Oh, that's a penalty. Oh, okay, maybe not. Gabori. Yes, get in. 3 1. Well, hopefully, fingers crossed, that's us with the win. It's still time, though. Oh, you never know, we might get another one here. Oof. I mean, when your confidence is up, you might as well. Right, let's take you off. Um, let's leave the rest for now. I don't particularly want to get a player sent off. Come on. Yes! Come on! The Georgian fans are going crazy even though there's none in the stands, but yeah. <laughs> Where's the fans? Where are you? Why is, why is there all these stewards here where there's no fans? It don't make sense. Wasting money. All right. Take off, oh, we can't take anybody else off, but yeah, jobs are good in. So, um, yeah, it's between us and Turkey now, whoever wins that game. Uh, if we draw, though, we might go down to goal difference. We might go through to the next stage on goal difference, but we'll see. Yeah, we're playing in four days' time. So I'll be back in a sec. Right, so we're back now with the Turkey game. Very important game for us. Let's see how we get on. We are in the white shirt. No, we're not. We're not in the white shirt. We are in the black shirt. I apologise for that. Um, first highlight goes to Turkey. Great ball, great goal. Just knew that was going in. Oh, no. Pass. He played. He was onside, wasn't he? We'll see. Hopefully not, but I think he was on side. Yeah. Time just run well. So yeah, we are now. We gotta get back in this game quick. Hopefully we do. Yes. Cavadonna. No VIR check as well, so that's good. One one. Back to being second. Um, yeah, we don't need to worry about the Poland-Portugal game. Portugal basically qualified. So even if they lose, they've still got four points, I think. No. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, let's concentrate on our game. We don't need to worry about them. Got a few players and injured already, and we're going to take off. Not good. Oh, and we're going to take off Cavadonna as well at some point. Great. Ah, our main player knackered. Uh oh. 
2-1. Can't take off Cappadonna unless, unless he's literally limping off the pitch. He's our main star. Come on, we've got to get a point here. Come on, lads. He did so well against Poland. Don't let us don't let don't let the fans down now. Oh, I'm gonna have to take off Cabadonna unfortunately. Right, they've got a point. If they score this, it's game over. Nothing we can do about it. We will really struggle to get without Cavadonna to get two goals. So they've got another corner though. The danger's not over yet. Good header out. Good, good defending. We've got another highlight. Doesn't this doesn't make me feel good. Oh, thank God for that. Right. Come on. Higher up. Let's see what that does. Free kick to us. Come on. This is where we get our equalizer. Come on. Yes, get in. I'll take that. I don't know what the hell happened there. I think it just come off. But yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh, we've got another one. Can we get a winner here? Can we get a winner? Can we get the lead? Oh, nearly. Right, is anybody playing poorly here? No, everybody's playing all right, to be honest. Such a shame Cavadon was so bloody knackered. Right, let's try encouraging the players. Take him. Oh, we can't take more players off anyway. Right, if things stay this same, we go through. If Turkey win, then we're out. And they look like they're going to score here. Yeah, they're going to score. Oh, good save. Good save. Come on. There's still hope. There's still hope. Right. I need to. I need to do some shit down, sorry. Very defensive. Play for set pieces. Right, how many minutes we got? Four minutes. Yes! Get in. We're through. Now, who are we playing? Right, so we'll qualify the second round. Play Norway. Oh god, Haaland and Odegaard. And we haven't got um Cavadonna for it because he's picked up a few yellow cards. Um so I'll be back in a sec with the Norway game. Right, so we're back now with the Turkey game. Very important game for us. Let's see how we get on. We are in the white shirt. No, we're not. We're not in the white shirt. We are in the black shirt. I apologise for that. Um, first highlight goes to Turkey. Great ball, great goal. Just knew that was going in. Oh, no. Pass. He played. He was onside, wasn't he? We'll see. Hopefully not, but I think he was onside. Yeah. Time just run, pal. So, yeah, we are now... We gotta get back in this game quick. Hopefully we do. Yes, Cavadonna. No VIR check as well, so that's good. One one. Back to being second. Um. Yeah, we don't need to worry about the Poland Portugal game. Portugal basically qualified. So even if they lose, they've still got four points, I think. No. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, let's concentrate on our game. We don't need to worry about them. Got a few players injured already and we've got to take off. Not good. Oh, and we've got to take off Cavadonna as well at some point. Great. Ah, our main player, knackered. Uh-oh. 2-1. Mm. Can't take off Cavadonna unless, unless he's literally limping off the pitch. He's our main star. Come on, we've got to get a point here. Come on, lads. 
he did so well against Poland. Don't let us, don't let, don't let the fans down now. Oh, I'm gonna have to take off Cabo Dono, unfortunately. Right, they've got a corner. If they score this, it's game over. Nothing we can do about it. We will really struggle to get without Cabo Dono to get two goals. But they've got another corner, though. The danger's not over yet. Good header out. Good, good defending. We've got another highlight. Doesn't this doesn't make me feel good? Oh, thank God for that. Right, come on, higher up. Let's see what that does. Free kick to us. Come on, this is where we get our equaliser. Come on. Yes, get in. I'll take that. I don't know what the hell happened there. I think it just come off. But yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh, we've got another one. Can we get a winner here? Can we get a winner? Can we get the lead? Oh, nearly. Right, is anybody playing poorly here? No, everybody's playing all right, to be honest. Such a shame Cavadon was so bloody knackered. Right, let's try encouraging the players. Taking it. Oh, we can't take more players off anyway. Right, if things stay this same we go through if turkey win then we're out and they look like they're going to score here yeah they're going to score oh good save good save come on there's still hope there's still hope all right i need to, I need to do some shit out sorry very defensive for set pieces right how many minutes we got four minutes yes get in we're through now who are we playing right so we'll qualify the second round play Norway oh god Haaland and Odegaard and we haven't got um, Cavadonna for it because he's picked up a few yellow cards. Um, so I'll be back in a sec with the Norway game. Right, so we're now playing Norway. Um, Cavadonna obviously not playing, but um, Kwasa Vashvili has done well this tournament. And we've got Lamarian as well. Um, so hopefully we've got the firepower book. We are playing. Look at, look at this team. Haaland. You got Nusser, um, Nipan, Odegaard, Milling. So, I mean, let's have a quick look then. Asia, Swarf, Shreva, Burj. They've got way better players than us. So, it's going to be a very difficult act here, especially when we haven't got Cavadonna on the pitch. Our only hope is if we somehow scrape a win here. And then we play against a, um, a rubbish nation in the next round. But I just don't see it happening. I think Norway's too good with Haaland. Then again, nothing's happening so far. We haven't had a shot yet, though, which is quite concerning. Are we just trying to play for extra time and penalties here and hope for the best? Right, I'll try and demand a bit more. Try firing up players, see if I'll do anything. Still zero shots on goal, but luckily for us, Norway. Ah, oh, they got a corner in. Here we go. Spoke too soon. Oh, that was lucky. Right, take you off. Put you on. Well, take you off. Um, no, I won't take you off. Right. We've, got, we've had one shot, at, so at least there's that. A bit rubbish, but... Yeah, I think I think this is just going to be two two teams that aren't very good, just trying to get a... Oh, stands corrected. Lamaria. Oh, okay. No. Not even worth it. It won't even, didn't even really test the goalkeeper that much. Right, we just need to take... Uh, Right back off. 
probably need to take that stroke for off in a minute. <clears throat> My throat's getting a bit fro uh, croaky now because I've been recording a couple of episodes, so I apologise in advance for that. So, Norway's throwing. I feel like they're going to score in like the last couple of minutes of the game and you can't do nothing about it. Uh, my only hope is if this stays nil nil, we go to extra time and then penalties, and then we just get a bit of luck in the penalty shootout. But that's, yeah, we'll just give them a penalty now. Why not? Why not just give them a penalty now? You know. <sighs> but yeah, oh, come on, come to our rescue, please. Yeah, not happening. Right, okay. Yeah, one nil. Come the man, come the hour. Harlan scores. 1-0. Right, so our only hope really now is to be more direct. Um, go wide. Let's go. Let's try mixed crosses. And then we'll just Hope we can get it into the box. We've got to do something because, I mean, look at that. That's all that is. We're going to get another one here, I think. We did well. We managed to get through the group stage. So there's that. And we only, we're only losing 1 0 at the moment at this current time. Might be 2 0, though, coming up. No, headed out. Harlan's still got the ball. Oh, block. Over. Right, we're just going to sit here now and just wait for the inevitable final whistle. Um, I feel like we could have done better with Cavadonna, but what can we do? He's a fiery man and he will get booked. But we did well. See, Georgia delighted. Uh, oh, he's disappointed, but oh well. Um, see, they said they're inevitable loss, so we, we have no chance really. Anyway, I'm off. That's it for me today. Knackered doing all these recordings. Um, I'll be back next week with this save, and and then tomorrow I'll have um another TW episode. So, yeah, I'll see you soon. All the best.